Hello, hi children. Good morning. I hope you're all well. Looking out to yourself, doing your classwork again and the challenges. Also, doing some form of exercise. You know what I'm going to say, the brain and the body. Keep you going. Don't be a couch potato. Today, this architecture is back with another cooking. Today, I am going to do my mashed potato and sausage starts. Um, really beautiful, very simple as well. But before we start anything, what do I tell you? Please, wash your hands before and after cooking. In between cooking, when you touch anything you shouldn't touch. Also, get an adult help. Because today you're using the cooker to boil your potatoes. Also, you're using the oven. You are using knife or peeler for your potatoes. You're also going to use these cocktail sticks for your sausage um, to do your stars. So please get an adult help. Also, when you're boiling the potatoes, it's hot. So please get an adult help. Now, so today, what are ingredients for these stars? Let's see. So for our stars, I got my potato. I've got one cook already, just the one. You peel it, you use your you peeler or you use your knife, but be careful, get an adult help. And then you boil it to a soft. Now I have got some mozzarella cheese. You can use whatever you want, as much as you want, but not too much though. At the moment, because I'm doing two stars, I have got only two tablespoons. I have got half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of white pepper. I've got some milk here. I've also got butter for my mash. And then I have got these sausages, the fried sausages. Or you can use the, the hot dog sausages, yeah? You can get um, vegetarian ones as well. If you're halal, you can get halal ones. So there's so many different ones. So before you do anything, what do I do? If you're listening and you're looking, I am going to cut my sausages into two. So I cut them and then I'll cut it again. As you can see, look, I'm cutting it again. Yeah, make sure everywhere is cut. Now you put your cocktail stick in there. We are making our stars, and then you pull it like that. Okay, and then you put it on your tray. Let's move everything so you can see it. So I put this on. This is one I created earlier. You put that on your tray like that, and then you cut it again. If you can see me, I hope you can. We cut it again. Make sure it's cut like that. It's open like that. Put your cocktail stick in there. Make careful you don't prick yourself with it. Now pull it apart like that. So you're making a star. Put it together like this. Look at the one I've done earlier. You cut it again. Your cocktail stick. Yeah. And then you pull it again. Don't forget. Don't prick yourself. And then you put that together as well. Okay. Now the last one. Cut it again. Now you put your cocktail stick in here. Don't forget not to, don't break it. Okay. There we go. Pull it really nicely, gently. Now you've got your stars. Look at that. For my stars. Done. You're ready for your potato, mash your potatoes. You see my stars. So let's see what happened next. Remember, I told you I have got potatoes cooked already. So I bought my potatoes, it's ready to be mashed. So, so when you put it, you have to strain it, use a strainer and get adult help. So I am mashing my potatoes. I put my salt in here. Salt and pepper goes in there. That's just a mixture. I've got my butter goes in here. Okay. It's hot as well, so be very careful when you're mashing again a dog's cup. So I mash it until it's nicely and smooth. You, you can taste the seasoning when you finish. Make sure you, you taste your seasoning to see if it's, it tastes really nice. Okay. Now add a little bit of milk, not too much. Normally you can eat people add um like eggs, but I don't want egg. I want milk so i add a little bit of milk in here not too much don't make it too runny or too um wet okay so there 
as you can see so we right mashed potato is finished it's ready now make sure you clean up by yourself now i have got my stars i'm bringing my stars my stars here so what i do make sure it's that is nicely together yeah there beautiful now i can it can also put a little bit of um like seasoning in there i like parsley or anything that green lovely seasoning in there okay i'm putting a bit of rosemary in there because i love rosemary and also i put a bit of parsley in here so there i put my parsley and i put my rosemary in here and I mix it nicely together you can put any herbs that you like in there you can put some chai because chai go really well with potatoes now fill your stars your potato and then make sure when you're filling it you uh you put it right in there go in fill every corner of your star there you go make sure everywhere has got put it together nicely spread it out there you go very nicely there you go children yeah smooth it use your spoon now we sprinkle with our cheese this is something i think you guys will really love it's really delicious you can put how much cheese you want spread it around make sure you got cheese every corner every little hand with the sir spread it around nice and easy and put it in the oven you're cooking it for uh, 10 minutes um 180 degrees Celsius for about for gas mark five for 10 minutes let's wait and see okay children sausage stars is there ready so after 10 minutes uh it depends on your oven as well your one might take a little bit longer here we go beautiful sausage stars and i am going to put it on my star plate so i scoop this oh and then you go to off to my star plate yes look at that sorry you hear the phone call me sammy was calling me so this can be you can serve this with a salad you can and then don't forget take this out take the cocktail sticks out because i don't want you if you forget it and you're eating it by mistake you can cut it so pull them all out you have four make sure all you got four sticks okay take it out so this is it sausage stars it's ready i am going to enjoy and i hope when you do it you will enjoy it as well um take care all of you um hope to come back soon uh, so yeah 